Hi friends, I welcome you all to Caesar's video classes again. Now our today's topic about one unknown hero of Indian history. Well, he's not a forgotten hero of Indian history because we forget those whom we have remembered sometime. But this gentleman, he was never remembered to us. This gentleman, he was never known to us. He is an unknown hero of Indian history. Today, we shall learn about him. Friends, I am talking about Major General Onkar Singh Kalkat, Param Vishish Sheva Medal of Indian Army. He bears testimony of a very, very vital secret of the armed history of Indian Army. I shall discuss that thing with you today. I hope that you will like my video, you will share my video and I am also confident that you have already subscribed to my channel. So let's start. Major General Omkar Singh Kalkat was born in undivided India in the year 1918. He studied economics and at the age of 24 only, he joined Indian Army. He also studied from the National Staff Defense College. And in the year 1947, when India was partitioned, he was posted as the Brigade Major of the Banu Brigadier Front. Today, that particular front is located in Pakistan. So during 1947, when very hastily India was divided into India and Pakistan, his posting was at in Pakistan that time. And he was waiting for his transfer to India. He was under the command of General C.P. Murray. General C.P. Murray was waiting for his transfer to England. Since Major General Onkar Singh Kalkat was posted in a very high rank, so he was authorized to open and read all the letters sent for his general C.P. Murray. A fateful day came on 20th August 1947. That was just five days after India's independence and six days after the independence of Pakistan. We all know that. Pakistan got independence on the 14th August 1947 and India got independence on the 15th August 1947. And on the 20th August 1947, just six days after independence of Pakistan, our Major General Onkar Singh Kalkat, that time he was the Brigade Major, he opened a letter that was written for his Brigadier Sir Sipin Mari. Do you know, friends, what was written in the letter? Yes, a foolproof plan of attacking the Kashmir region of India. A foolproof plan planted by Pakistan. They also gave a name of that particular plan. An army operation. The name of the plan was Operation Gulmark because to capture the regions of the Kashmir from the hands of India. This letter was written to C.P. Murray from General Frank Walter Masarvi. Brigade Major Unkar Singh Kalkat was shell shocked. He immediately brought the matter before his officer C.P. Murray. C.P. Murray told him to keep mum. He told him Kalkat, please keep mum, otherwise you will be incarcerated. Otherwise, Pakistan will get you imprisoned. You may also be killed. So please be careful. But somehow, the matter leaked. And our Kalkat sir, he was brought under home arrest and put behind the bars by Pakistan. But our Kalkat sir, he was a real hero. He was a great patriot. He fled from the clutches of Pakistan and somehow he managed to come to India. Now, Kalkat, he came to India 
फर्स्ट ही रीच द अम्बला ऑफ प्रेजेंट डेज हरियाणा देन ही वॉज रशिंग टूअर्ड्स दिल्ली हिज ओनली ऑब्जेक्टिव वॉज टू पुट द मेटर बिफोर द इंडियन अथोरिटीज ही इवन डिडेंट केयर फॉर हिज फैमिली ही सम हाउ मैनेज टू सेंड हिज फैमिली एवे फ्रॉम पाकिस्तान but he had no idea he had no information he had no knowledge where his family members were there but he was rushing towards delhi to keep the matter before his authorities and how did he go to delhi so that he doesn't come into anybody's notice he came to delhi by a good straight straight away he went to the army headquarters he met his officers he met brigadier kalwan singh he met his dgmo pn thapar even he briefed the matter before the then defense minister sardar baldev singh but all were complicit in taking action against the proposed pakistan plan of attacking kashmir operation gulmarg so that only happened what was supposed to happen since nobody took any notice or took any heed of what kalkat said so pakistan got ample of time to plan themselves for the operation gulmarg when in the month of october 1947 pakistan launched their attack on india the kashmir region of india the maharaja of kashmir sent an sos to india to save kashmir from the pakistani harmats then only everybody remembered what kalkat had said frustrated kalkat he was in search of his family in eastern punjab and he was only traced on the 24th october of 1947 and when he was traced he was taken straight to our prime minister jawaharlal nehru jawaharlal nehru listened everything in detail from kolkata he was surprised to know the complicity of the authorities in respecting what kolkata had said about the operation gulmarg jawaharlal nehru shouted and scolded each and everybody responsible for this thing kolkata was highly praised for his bravery this gentleman later on served the indian army with bravery in the year 1971 during the india pakistan war he was posted in the western part of india and he recovered as many as 31 ports from the pakistan clutches after his retirement at an age of 54 only he served the indian army as a officer in the research and analysis wing what we say as ro he was awarded param vishish seva medal for his service to his country in the year 1983 he wrote one autobiography the name of his autobiography is far flung frontiers please read this book you will get to know everything you will get to know every detail about the life history of major general onkar singh kalkat and you will get every detail about the battle between india and pakistan for occupying different parts of kashmir if we all had paid heed to the words of kolkat then the entire region of kashmir should have been with india kashmir wouldn't have been divided in three parts we shouldn't tell that this is pak occupied kashmir we couldn't have told that this is india occupied kashmir we couldn't have told that this is azad kashmir there would have been only one integrated kashmir under india had we paid to the advices and suggestions of major general onkar singh kalkat so this is a huge price what india had to pay because we didn't pay any heed to the warnings given by our army officer this brave army officer major general onkar singh kalkat i hope you have liked this video and i promise to bring such videos in our future video sessions also so i conclude here today please don't forget to share this video to your friends i i need and i want that everybody should know about this unknown hero of india 
we all love our motherland god bless us all thank you